Hey, this is Jackie Witt at Adios Adventure Travel. Guess who I'm with? Hey guys, this is Vidal from Adios Adventure Travel. We're in Cusco, and uh, so we've been uh, visiting Machu Picchu, the Inca Trail, and Vidal and I have uh, some information for you for people who are interested in booking trips in 2021. Here's what you need to know. So this is a small update about Machu Picchu, Inca Trail and some of the changes that we have. First, um, about Machu Picchu. Um, the entry tickets that you can find is just a general entry fee. And uh, but nowadays they do have new routes, new experiences like Machu Picchu with the Sun Gate, Machu Picchu with uh, the drawbridge, just like what they used to have Machu Picchu with Huayna Picchu. But those new experiences are not available yet. What they have uh, now is just general entry tickets only, uh, the ones that they are open till January the 10th. And uh, the, the government has been releasing those tickets slowly, um, but now um, they are open just till January the 10th. And obviously later on they keep releasing new dates. The four day Inca Trail is not open yet, it's not available. Uh, and we, we don't really know when they will open it. They say that once when the COVID cases kind of slows up and came to be normal, but we know that we are not getting back into a normal situation. COVID, we have to learn to coexist with COVID. And uh, uh, they, will, they will start selling those tickets as soon as this becomes to be a little more normal. Uh, now the two-day Inca Trail um, is available. And it's the same as the schedule of Machu Picchu in general entry fee. I mean, you can find it there. But obviously, it's an operator, the one that will let you get in. You cannot just go on your own trying to do the two-day hike. Yeah, those are the uh, some of those uh, new um, changes over there. And Jackie Nam will give you some tips about booking on 2021. So people are asking about, you know, should I book a trip in 2021? What should I do? Because things are always changing, even, you know, the day after you book something, you know, circumstances could change. So the first thing I recommend is that you um, book a refundable flight uh, because that is your biggest expense usually. And then secondly, and everybody should be buying travel insurance, comprehensive travel insurance that covers all your expenses and uh, all your flights, all your ground, all your hotels. It should cover everything, your guides, your entry tickets, um, just because everything is in flux right now. Um, the third thing I recommend is to find a tour operator who will give you, you know, some uh, risk-free cancellation policies, uh, access to refundable um, kinds of tours and activities. We're able to set up trips to Machu Picchu with 100% refund up to 16 days prior to arrival. Of course, that doesn't help, you know, for the last 15 days before you get here, a lot of things could happen. So that's why you need travel insurance. You know, we do want to guarantee things like your entry tickets and your um, train tickets. So that's why we, you know, set it up like this. So if you have any questions, just contact us at um, info at adiosadventuretravel.com. Um, we're trying to be uh, informative. We're trying to keep everybody up to date. And we'll tell you what we can do and what we can't do. I mean, that's the bottom line. We're all in this together and we're here to help you. Do you so have guys, anything else? No. So guys, uh, feel free to send us an email and we'll be right on top to to let you know whatever is happening around here. All right? Adios. Keep in touch.